In today's video, I'm going to make five easy projects over the course of five days using one piece of foam. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to make yet. Let's just make five little easy projects over the course of five days together. So, the premise of this challenge was one project a day for five days in a row. To make it easy, I decided to start the challenge on Monday. This is day one, and I've decided to make a little wizard's desk. I did decide, however, to not pay attention to scale too much. I just wanted to cut the foam without making measurements and start crafting. The focus of this challenge is much more about having fun with the craft. As long as it looks good and I enjoy the process, then I'm happy. This way, I'm going to spend all five days having a good Time. In a way I kind of see this challenge as a bit of a palate cleanser, something to keep you crafting while your brain resets and prepares for that next big epic project. A little bit later in this video I will be announcing the winner of the giveaway from my Dwarven Statues video. Another thing to look forward to in this video is the gratuitous use of cheesy camera trick transitions like this one. Day two, Tuesday, and I'm going to take one of the off cuts from yesterday and I'm going to see if I can turn it into a bookcase. First we need a bottom panel, close the gap, top panel, side panel, switch it around, other side panel, then back panel, a couple of shelves, then move it out, some books, there we go, that should be enough to complete a bookcase. So far so good, really like these. Two down, three more to go, it's Wednesday. Hmm, this might come in handy for the next project. Ooh cool, a spare ring. I wonder what happens if I put it on. Hmm. All this fluffy crap. Oh, never gonna get anything done.
ta-da! As you can see, I went ahead and painted and flocked it. My battery ran out last night and I wanted to get it finished on Wednesday. It's Thursday, we're gonna move on to the next project and we'll get our flocking fixed with this one, I think. Remember this little core piece from my last project? Well, I think this kind of looks like a tree trunk. So for this next project, I'm gonna be making some kind of woodsman's corner, wood chopping pile kind of thing. Let's see what happens. So this whole five little mini projects in five days idea actually came out of a complete and utter creative block. I didn't have a clue what to build, I wanted to build something big but I didn't have any ideas. So I thought rather than trying to do something big and impressive, just do something fun. So if you're having a bit of a creative block out there, why not try some smaller projects? It keeps you making and once you're in the flow you do actually come up with some cool little ideas that you might not have done before, like this little wood pile. I don't know where that idea came from. Anyway, this is also an opportunity just to say a massive thanks to all of the people who are scrolling across the bottom of the screen right now. You guys are also a big source of inspiration to me. Keep supporting me and I absolutely appreciate every single one of you. Thank you guys so much. Coat of Black Mod Podge done. All that's left to do is the paint job and it. <laughs> Flocky. Oops. One more detail to go though. So you might be wondering why there's a little man walking across the bottom of the screen right now and the answer is that I am actually distracting you from the terrible paint job and unnecessarily long and boring painting footage. The reason why I needed that unnecessary long and boring piece of footage is that it fills out this segment so that the music ends right at the end, if that makes any sense. Anyway, here's my finished wood pile. Friday and it's the last day of the challenge. I wonder if the microphone's picking that up. Man, it's just started hailing. What on earth? So, sanding a little MDF base. It's Friday, last project. We're going to make an outhouse. So while I have some nice footage on screen of me using my carving knife to make some wood texture, I am reminded that in my last video I started a giveaway draw for a brand new set of carving tools and gloves. Thanks to everyone who left a comment on the video, alas there can only be one winner and that winner chosen completely by random draw is Eric Prince. Congratulations, I will be in touch with you this afternoon to find out where I have to send the prize. To everyone else, thank you for your comments. I really enjoyed reading them and I tried to reply to everyone. Comments really do help the videos perform better here on YouTube. So now I've mentioned it, please let me know in the comments below of this video which one of these five little projects that I've made is your favorite and why. And while you're at it, I would massively appreciate it if you would also click the like button for me. Thank you guys so much. The last few flocking touches on my outhouse that's the end of an awesome week's crafting for me i've had a lot of fun with this challenge and i highly recommend anyone giving it a try out there if you do decide to give a five day challenge a try why not share your results with me over on discord if you need a link please let me know in the comments below if you enjoyed this video please push the like button and say hello to me in the comments thanks for watching and until next we meet nalaway go vanity